welcome to or back to my channel i wasn't planning on vlogging today but i have a pretty packed day full of work and i thought it would be fun to bring you along it is a work from home day hence the really comfy outfit i have a full day of meetings for super goop and if you didn't watch my last day in a life of an intern video then you might not know, but I am interning for Supergoop, which is a cosmetic SPF brand. I am a product development intern, which means I work with the PD team on all things new product development, upcoming launches, reformulations, things like that. Today and tomorrow are gonna be some pretty jam-packed days with some deadlines that I have to hit and a presentation that is really important. But anyways, let's talk about what we have on the agenda. I just got off of a meeting right now. We were meeting with one of our labs for an upcoming launch, basically trying to get the formulation just right. I just kind of observe and learn as much as I can. I have another meeting at 11.30, but in the meantime, I'm gonna do some work for an intern project. We basically have to come up with a product concept that has not been launched yet, but is in demand and present it to the product development team. And we kind of take it through like a mock-up process that NPD would normally do. So I'm currently working on the intern project. Um, we're basically presenting a mock-up of a cream, bronzer, blush, and highlight trio, and we are trying to find some good ingredients for the formulation of it. And this is what the presentation is looking like so far. I'm gonna keep working on this for the next 20 minutes. I'm just going through Sephora's website trying to find some shade range examples so we can put together a mock-up shade range. salad or soup or something and also pick up my second coffee of the day because I'm seriously feeling the brain fatigue. I have secured the latte meeting in 15 minutes. Still need to heat up my food and probably just gonna have to eat while I work but Let's head back. Today is a busy day. I'm really happy I decided to bring you along because I wasn't expecting it to be this jam-packed, but hopefully it's really interesting for you and I'm really excited that I get to like share this part of my journey with you. I just got home and had to hop on a meeting, but let me show you what I got for lunch. Salmon, some asparagus, and some baby potatoes. I'm gonna eat this while I sit in on this meeting. <music> shade range for the product proposal because this is a proposal we obviously had to come up with a mock-up shade range and this is what we came up with if you know the kaja bento cream blush and bronzer trio then this is very similar but it has spf since it's super goop shade one two three four and five obviously wanted it to be super inclusive so we did research on undertones that fit each these are mainly shade examples from the Say bronzer, and then this is a NARS one that's like really light for really fair skin. And then corresponding blushes and corresponding highlights, so when it is all put together in a trio, these are the three that go into it. And then I can just show you some of how I organized my research for this project. So at the beginning, I did a competitive analysis of different products on the market that are very similar and comparable to what we're trying to make. So you kind of list the pros and cons, the price point, the concept of it, and the ingredient, just things like that. So you can get like a really clear idea of what's out there and what's missing. 
and then here was where I was organizing the research for the actual presentation and our target audience, industry trend, ingredients that we knew we wanted to include, and then I had references for the shade range. So I just did all of that in Google Sheets, but I just wanted to show you how I organized this. <music> I am about to start my last project for the day. It is currently 3.40, which means there's about an hour and a half left of the workday. I have one more meeting left at four and then I will be done. But I'm going to create an agenda for a meeting that I am leading tomorrow with my manager. It's just a touch base meeting. So I'm just gonna create the agenda for that and I will show you what it looks like when I'm done. <laughs> for Basique Jewelry and I'm in on time and now there's 10 minutes left in my workday. It is officially 5 o'clock which means I am done and I just finished the agenda for the touch base meeting tomorrow. Like this, that's the first page and then that is like findings from the competitive analysis but now I think I'm just going to finish this off really quickly and then probably rest for the rest of the evening or edit but I'm very happy to be done for the day. At Central Market, we're gonna get some ingredients for dinner. Since some of my older videos, I haven't shown you the updates in my living room and I have made some and I'm super happy with them. So I got these really flowy, pretty sheer curtains from Ikea and I just love how they look with the whole living room together. I got this cream color carpet from Amazon, which I really love and it wasn't too expensive, so I'll link it down below. Just two really simple updates I made here that I feel like really upgraded this space. Dinner is served and this is what we're having. I made a spinach fettuccine pasta with some pesto and then I just did this like Caesar salad. Well, I used vegan ranch, so it's not really Caesar, but I made a little side salad. I am so excited to just sit here, do nothing and eat my dinner. <laughs> for the day. I only have three meetings today, which is really nice. Now I'm going to go through a presentation that I'm doing today for the product development managers with two other interns. Um, the one that I was working on yesterday, I just need to script my part because I'm explaining the research portion of it, which needs to be a little bit more structured. I'm gonna set you down because I am going to hop on to my meeting in two minutes. <laughs> my meeting at 10 30 to get a coffee i don't know when i became so dependent on caffeine i'm not really mad about it so i'm just coming to merit to pick up a coffee um which is exciting for me i get so excited when i get to get my coffee <laughs> detailed version 
with that presentation and it went pretty well. Um, lots of feedback and the final presentation is next week. But anyways, now I'm going to work on my next project. Usually under skincare or makeup products, they have like some efficacy claims, like if they've done clinical studies for this product. And that's basically how they're able to claim like 24 hours of hydration or like six hours of color staying power. I am going to go through different products, consumer and clinical studies that are available online and kind of copy and paste them all into one big document. <laughs> dinner time now and we're gonna make veggie pizzas tonight so it is time to assemble it. to bring you along for a typical work from home day. I really hope you liked this type of video and if you want more like this then make sure you like and subscribe. It means a lot to me. But yes, it has been a very productive but long day. So thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy these type of videos and I will see you in my next one.